Yo, 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 what's going on? It's your boy Jay Mitch. I'm out here today with my Serpent 989E. Uh, it's actually a purpose built drag build for me, but of course, I didn't drag run this season. I feel like I've been building this car for a long time. I've shown pictures of it, but never really shown any running video of it. This is literally going to be the second or third time I run this car, but I kind of wanted to give you guys a, a build overview of what we had going on with her. I got this cool paint job done by Mr. Barry Gamble. Thank you, Barry Gamble, for hooking me up with the paint job. It was uh, inspired by an uh, Instagram painter, uh, School of Squallow Art. I don't know how to say his name, um, but check him out. Um, but yeah, he does some great serpent uh, work, so check him out too. Um, some dope paint jobs. But anyway, I'm talking too much to show y'all the car. Like I said, this is a purpose-built drag car, and I actually do have installed already the serpent um, wheelie bar. Serpent drag wheelie bar. That's crazy. They made it for this car. I'm gonna take the hood off and let you guys see what I got going on underneath her. As you guys can see up front, I you can't see it, but I do have a front one-way uh, lock spool, front one-way locker on the car. I got this from Mr. Ty Ming. Um, so you guys should know him if you do serpents. That's one of the guys you want to know if you need this kind of work done. Uh, you need that front one-way locked. Uh, I've tried uh, JB Weld. That stuff didn't work. A couple different options work. You really gotta have uh, the, uh, have um, this thing locked manually. Um, also, I am running the Futaba uh, Gyro on the car. Um, also, I'm running the Castle um, Mamba Monster X. Um, also, I'm running the TP Power uh, 4050 can. Um, also, I do have like all the aluminum pulleys, with the exception of the pulley back here. That's that's not aluminum, I think it's a plastic one back there, but all the other ones are aluminum upgraded. Um, that's another reason why the car took so long to build because it's hard to get those pulleys. Um, you kind of, as soon as Serpent America has them on sale, they get bought up really quick. Uh, so you get what you get. I'm also running a Savox Black Edition uh, servo, um, and I'm also running the Futaba receiver. And today I am running the Roaring Top. Uh, that's lipo uh, uh, 5500 uh, 70c uh, 5s lipo is just in this car right now and of course I am running the saga gears on the car man you got to do that and what's really cool about the 989 E's it's basically a 989 nitro with a, a factory uh, brushless conversion kit on it um, so it's pretty cool it also has like this dual deck design for your ESC and some, some more rigidity in the middle there um, and also the uh, plates, uh, the battery trays, the carbon fiber battery trays. Really, really cool design car here. And actually, what's really, really cool about this car is I built it myself. Usually, I buy a Serpent already built, or I have you know one of my buddies at the hobby shop, namely Ted or or somebody like that, build the car for me. But now, nah, your yeah, man built this car all itself from the kit. I did have Ted uh, come through and help set up the car for me. Actually, you know, put the setup station and get it dialed in to go straight. Um, these cars are like a piece of jewelry. They really require some fine tuning. Um, so you really have to uh, pay special attention to setting up the car. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get to the running portion of the video. But before I do, I'm going to say, if you haven't yet, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Uh, check out my socials. I'm leaving all the links and all the, uh, the build details in the uh, video description. All right, next thing you guys will see is some footage from my... Uh, GoPro 10 of this car running. Stay tuned. Alright guys. Let y'all see what she got going on. This is only 5S guys. I want y'all to see how smooth she really is. Yeah, I do have the gyro in the car, but it's not actually on, on right now. Yo, 
box here. She's super fast, man. You guys got lucky. You guys didn't have to line up against her this season. She'll be out next season, though. It's a nice little, nice little whip. smooth man y'all hear how quiet that is but you guys really can't hear the quietness because it's getting some roofing done on the houses today but y'all gotta see how, how sharp and smooth this car is man this car is really a machine it's really a piece of jewelry really a piece of, of art um but yeah i just kind of wanted to show y'all what she could do if my gyro was on and it wasn't so congested i would do a a full trigger pull let's just see ain't nothing, nothing coming What you get for for showing off up on the wheelie bar there all right have to take a look at what that is something's not happy in there anyway i'm gonna go ahead and end it i'm gonna see what i got going on underneath here just like something's binded up oh looks like my belt came off but all right i'm gonna go ahead and end it i'm gonna say thank you guys for watching um, shout out to Dave Hubbard, shout out to Big Willie, shout out to Ted and Adam at RC Discount, and shout out to all y'all for supporting your boy's channel. Thank y'all for watching, y'all be good now, peace.